Since drones have become popular, people began to improve this flying machines in every possible ways. They even came up with an idea how to use it for fishing, but sometimes they go too far. And today, we have top 15 stupid and absurd things people have done with drones. Quadcopters with fireworks, guns, and chainsaw. From deadly toys to toys for adults. Yes, people even use drones in porno films. So let's go. The Texas Chainsaw Massacre might seem a pleasant picture compared to these guys' technological invention. Crazy people calling themselves Crazy Finnish Farmers came up with an idea to attach a chainsaw to a drone. Tough guys launched this dangerous weapon to destroy snowmen, pine trees, and icicles. By the way, this invention might be regarded as useful, for example to cut dry tree branches or dangerous icicles hanging from rooftops. In addition, there is an efficient way to stop a chainsaw drone for those who are especially scared. These are common air balloons. How do they work? Check it out. The following idea is for people who love getting an adrenaline rush, but we do not recommend anybody repeat it. It is a firework battles that guys from the Netherlands came up with. They launched drones with Roman candles attached, lit up their wicks, and they rushed. Here is another type of war. Guys attached Roman candles to a drone gave a remote control to a pilot, lit up the fireworks, and started running away. It was a grand hunt. Each of them got at least one charge. Orville Cat Drone Orville died in 2012 after a car hit it. His owner, Bart Janssen, named his cat after one of the Wright brothers. When Orville died, Janssen decided that it would be a shame to simply bury his pet. He decided to make a dummy of its body, then he attached it to the drone. Doing that, the owner thinks the cat spirit will always stay next to him in the air. Born to be a driver. This is an epic idea. I am sure everyone who used to play a popular GTA video game would love to drive a car like in the game, at least once. Tom Scott, British blogger, created a unique system to pilot a car with a drone. As the inventor says, the gadget connects VR glasses to a drone flying over the car. The driver may choose several visibility modes. They are from the first or third person. For especially lazy people, Chris Early, a citizen of Knoxville, took his daughter to school with the help of a drone. Early arrived at this creative solution after his eight-year-old Katie asked her father to go to school by herself. The drone spying on a kid gave her independence, and her father felt safe for her. By the way, the daughter didn't mind a drone spying on her, saying it was cool. If a father taking his daughter to school with a drone was reproved, a drone accompanying a dog seems to be acceptable. Any lazy dog owner can follow an example of Jeff Myers from the USA. Weapon for Art or Vandalism an artist named Katsu rearranged a drone for his own needs. He attached a spray and a paint can to it. The drone can fly with the paint and draw on the surface of any tall building. Perhaps this technology will become a breakthrough in graffiti, because now your little vandal can raise your little vandal to any height. That's what Katsu did. He used his drone to draw on a huge billboard with Calvin Klein jeans advertisement in one of New York districts. He fixed a paint can on a drone and directed it to the face of Kendall Jenner to paint several meaningless lines in her photo. And the last positive place is occupied by this kind of drones. Their usage can be taken as the point when one can say drones have penetrated into all spheres of life, absolutely all of them. This toy to shoot 21 plus films is called Dildo Drone. When Johnny Sins is on vacation, someone happens to be taking his position. I don't think it is necessary to explain what is censored on this drone. Surely, these are not Roman candles.
I have to admit that drone owners are creative and smart people. They even came up with an idea, how to use it for fishing. You would ask how? It seems very easy. There are three different fishing types. One is more creative than the other. The first type consists in attaching your tackle directly to the drone. Your camera being already there as well, now you can cut fish at the right moment. The second way is when the drone transports your tackle for over 150 meters away from the riverbank, and then it casts your tackle into the water. Also, the camera helps you spot the best location for casting. Human Torch Creative agencies are using the advantages of modern technology to the most extent. Thinkmodo created a viral video to advertise yet another blockbuster from Marvel. They used the idea of Human Torch from the comics Fantastic Four. A drone with a fixed burning doll was supposed to portray one of the movie characters, Johnny Storm. Teen equips drone with flamethrower to roast a holiday turkey. Connecticut teenager uploaded a video to YouTube showing a quadcopter with a working flamethrower attached to it that was being used to literally roast a turkey. He obviously home-built flamethrowing drone is actually a pretty cool custom. In fact, the YouTube video included links to several quadcopter components that were used to construct it. Deadly Toy the most scandalous and weird way of any drone use happened in the USA in July 2015. An 18-year-old student, a future engineer, invented an unusual device, a flying gun, and filmed it in action. A dangerous invention was attached to a regular drone from the Federal USA Aviation Management. Soon the guy was arrested by state police for interrogation. The video itself was very popular, getting 3.5 million views. Just like in everything else, pilotless gadgets have their positive and negative ideas. Tijuana Municipal Police representatives found a crashed drone at the border between Mexico and the USA. It was transporting a six-pound pack of meth wrapped in a plastic bag. This cost over $48,000 US in the US black market. The drone crashed because the weight was too heavy, police technicians commented after examining the device. Drug traffickers were too greedy. Drug trafficking through the U.S. border has its long history. With drones becoming more popular, the authorities have faced one more challenge, as radars cannot identify them. At night, drones often deliver tobacco, drugs, and mobile phone badges and other useful things, which they drop unnoticed into jail backyards. At night, a drone was suspiciously circling over the official U.S. president's residency. The system designed to detect flying objects didn't notice it. The drone belonged to one of the government members who decided to pull a prank on his colleagues, but he created a stir next to the White House that is secured for 24 hours and 7 days a week. Secret Service officers responded to the southern part of the White House territory, saw and heard that drone, but nobody could catch it.